Hello, my name is Bobby Brooks Jr. I'm the son of Billy Brooks, who's running for mayor of Rivera Beach. And uh, to share some information about her that people may not be aware of, why well, I believe she is the best candidate to run for mayor uh, for the city of Rivera Beach. Uh, first off, I think my mom's gonna be a great representative for the city. Uh, my mom's been exposed to many politicians, dignitaries. Years ago when I was a kid, she and my dad were invited out to the White House to meet King, King, of, King and Queen of Spain. Uh, they've met kings and queens, the presidents. Um, she's been exposed to people on, on various levels uh, and is able to relate to them and express her opinions and thoughts very well and to represent uh, the city very well. So uh, the role of the mayor's one was a, a ceremonial position of being the face of the city and I believe she would be a very good representation for the city of Rivera Beach. My mom also could be very sensitive to the needs and the special requirements for business owners and entrepreneurs. Uh, she owned her own business for a number of years, getaway travel, which is very successful. However, I saw the struggle as a child. I saw the late hours. I saw when things were tough financially for uh, the business and the family and how uh, she had to really press her way through to overcome those initial years of building a business and being successful in the business and exposing your business to people in the community. Uh, so she understands and can relate to those who are business owners who've gone through that struggle uh, as entrepreneurs. And she would definitely be a, a friend of those who are business owners, entrepreneurs in the city of Rivera Beach. Um, she's also been able to um, have training in the area of finances. Uh, she once served as the chairman of the, uh, the police officer's pension board. And uh, as a part of that particular training, uh, you have to get a certification uh, for pension, public pension boards. And uh, she's gone through training, which is an extensive training. You have to pass tests, you have to do ongoing uh, development also as well to keep your certification. So she's very well of financial aspects that help to keep the city moving forward because uh, she's been trained and has certifications as such. So she definitely has a, a great handle on the financial needs of the city as well. Now my mom served already in the city council. Uh, she uh, helped to bring in uh, some definite growth in the uh, area of the Ocean Mall and the Ocean Mall walkway. She was part of the group of commissioners who helped to build that, move that forward. Also the transformation of Newcomb Hall, which we used to do back in the day, to the now the event center, which is one of the central hubs of the city now, which is doing great things for people all throughout the county. And so she was a part of the group of uh, of commissioners and a group of uh, council people who really helped move forward in that particular area for political accomplishments. Now, a lot of you are not sure of this information, but my mom also spent a number of years as a social worker. And so she understands not only just the business aspect of things, but the needs of the social needs that we have within our community. Uh, she was once a director of 4Cs, which is a social organization that helped those who were disfranchised, those who needed help, those who needed assistance. And so she has a heart for those who have the needs. And uh, that's always been something that's been a part of her. And really on a personal level, um, I can tell you, I've seen that heart go beyond just in the, in, the, in the level of being with the four C's. In our home purse, my mom's taken a number of people as a kid growing up, which I didn't care for too much back in the day. Uh, people coming into our house to live with us who were down and out. My mom brought them in because she cared for them. Um, people aren't aware of that. She didn't do it for pomp and circumstance to be seen by cameras. She did it because she had a genuine heart for people, people in need. And so she would bring people into our home periodically over, over the years to help them get a foot up and to move forward. Um, I've been able to acclaim or receive some sisters as a part of that uh, who grew up in our home with us for a number of months and years. And uh, I appreciate it now. I didn't appreciate it back then, but now I can see to that heart that she has, that's something I pray I can have also as well. My mom also understands the important needs in our educational system in Palm Beach County. Uh, she's been very instrumental uh, in helping schools who have support get support. Uh, there was a time when I was working at JFK Middle School where she uh, stood to the need that we as a school at JFK Middle, the school was at risk of being taken over by the state that particular year if we didn't move our grade up to the grade. And uh, she rallied many members of the community to come together and to work with the school and to volunteer at JFK Middle School to help screen the school grade up. And we were successful in moving that grade up at the school. Uh, and she was definitely a part of that. And the community she helped bring in to work with the school was also part of the success of JFK. Now she's also recently has helped also a number of schools in River Beach to get received reading rooms also as well. And uh, so she definitely has a heart for helping the schools in our community. She knows the importance of helping move our students forward educationally. One thing my mom has, I believe everyone does who's running for city council or mayor, uh, a love for the city. But I think one of the things that put my mom uh, at, at the top of the game of this is that she's also can be a very strong consensus builder. Uh, just one of the things I saw my dad do when he was mayor of the city of River Beach where a time period where people were very divided and were not really coming together, uh, he was able to really bring consensus among the city. 
I see my mom having the same ability also as well. I think there's a need now, especially with our council in the city, to bring others together. I think my mom has a great skill in being able to take people from where they are and help them see the, the unity we can have together with one another and the need we have to be united to move our city forward in direction uh, that it needs to move in. So I believe she can be a really strong consensus builder for the city of River Beach, helping the council, uh, helping the, the city manager, helping all those workers in the city to really come together to move River Beach forward to be the city that we really truly can and should be. So I definitely suggest all of you, um, please support Billy Brooks in her run for the mayor of the city of Rivera Beach.